the 35 watt handheld heater it kind of looks like it's right out of science fiction its function to keep your hands warm or maybe put into your sleeping bag at night now before we get into the chassis and electrical components let us discuss the common materials used for this small handheld heater. The body is made from 6 inch aluminum gutter. The heat dissipating handles on the end caps are made from rolled aluminum. The natural shape of the front side of the gutter helps direct the heat generated from the halogen light inside the heater box. The heating element is a 35 watt bi-pin halogen light bulb. The pins of the heating element are inserted into the GY 6.35 base socket. The halogen base socket is attached to the base socket brackets which in turn are attached to the chassis. The brackets are attached to the chassis using number 8 one half inch sheet metal screw. The chassis is an aluminum strip cut to 7 inches in length. All aluminum strips are tab design shaped to be easily put together. Now you want to drill holes in the faceplate for proper air circulation. At this stage of the build you want to secure the chassis to the faceplate. Now that you're familiar with all the parts, let's put it back together. Install the chassis and faceplate to the body of the heater. Carefully place the electrical leads between the faceplate and the bottom of the heater unit. Be sure to crimp and secure the faceplate to the heater body. Now hook up your new heater to a 12 volt DC power source. Maybe you want to use it as a window defroster. From the ship or on the shore at the ski lodge, in your cabin, a camper, or a tent, the personal homemade heater, 35 watts, used with any 12 volt DC lawn and garden battery. <laughs>